Dry conditions causing issues for southern New England firefighters. Today, crews had to put out this fire here, a brush fire in Providence, which comes just uh, one day after a brush fire in North Attleboro and a handful of similar fires last week. As 12 News reporter Kayla Fish explains, with more dry, breezy weather expected this week, fire officials want everyone to take steps to reduce their risk. Kayla. A spokesperson for DEM tells me they were planning to conduct a prescribed burn on Monday designed in part to reduce the risk of wildfires, but they had to postpone that due to the current weather conditions and because their crews needed a rest after fighting brush fires last week. From Bristol to Chipachet, brush fires have been keeping local firefighters busy. So they called for more help immediately. And then um, they were a little concerned with how, how fast it was traveling up the hill. Monday afternoon, crews in Providence put out a fire that was spreading quickly through parts of New to Connecticut Park on Plainfield Street, tackling it from all sides before it could spread towards nearby homes. If we had a windy day, we would have had more of a problem with it. Um, it's definitely dry, but, you know, the wind would have really given us issues, too. But with windy weather expected Tuesday, as well as low humidity and dry conditions, a brush fire weather watch is in effect. Right now, just don't burn at all. Potterville Volunteer Fire Chief Rob Greenway tells me the town of Situate won't be issuing any burn permits in the near future. That means no outdoor fire pits, which he says they get called to a lot when the weather is nice. Yes, we get calls all the time of people that just did it without calling for a permit. And a lot of times we'll get called off of smoke in the area and go out and ask them to extinguish it. On Sunday, more than 10 departments Departments responded to North Attleboro to fight a brush fire there that consumed about 12 acres. And with the weather conditions expected this week, the chief had this message. People need to be mindful and, uh, and obviously if there is no burning, then there is no burning. Um, but if they see smoke or they smell smoke or they see a fire, quickly call 911 and get the firefighters moving in a quick fashion so we can get the fire under control. And back at DEM, a spokesperson tells me they're looking at potentially trying another prescribed burn for later this week, but that, of course, all depends on the weather. I'm Kayla Fish, 12 News.